Today I'll be showing you from a Mac computer, so it's a little different for Windows, but basically the same thing. Once you are into the account, you go down here to My Webinars, because this is a webinar to Facebook Live. You're going to schedule a webinar. Under the topic, you're going to type a description. This is just for Zoom purposes. This doesn't go on Facebook. So we type a generic description so we can find it later. Generic topic, no description. You're going to pick a time that the webinar is going to go live. Approximately, it doesn't have to be exact. So we're going to go with 11 a.m. We're going to schedule it for one hour and 15 minutes. And you're going to select the time zone that matches the time that it's going. So Eastern Time US, we are not selecting recurring webinar. You do not need registration. Under video, you want to turn on the video for the host and the panelist. For audio, you want both. Under here, you do not need to require password. And you do not need a Q&A session. You do not need a practice section. And do not select record webinar automatically because it will record all of the stuff that you talk about before you actually launch it. So leave all of the webinar options blank there. Then once you're done, you hit schedule. Once it's scheduled, it'll look like this. And then you're going to go down to this tab here. Under invitations, you're going to send an invitation email to your guest that you're going to be interviewing. So here I'm just going to invite myself for this demonstration. Once you save it, that person will receive an email. And once it's the appropriate time to launch the webinar, you're going to hit start the webinar. Once you are into the Zoom screen here, you are going to hit the three dots. Once your panelist joins, you're going to hit the three dots. You're going to hit live to Facebook. You want to have your, your Zoom window open and your web browser open at the same time so you can see both of them. Here you're going to select whichever page you manage that the webinar is going live to. So in this case, I'm pretending to do a champion success profile. This is just a fake one for demonstrations. These two should match. You should not be posting it from your personal account. You want to select whichever one matches. You're going to hit next. Once it starts preparing the webinar, you'll see on the Zoom screen that it says preparing. Once it says live there, you are live. But we have to go ahead and put the title in. So this is the title for Facebook under this Facebook screen here. So this is going to be Champ Success Interview Testing testing one two three because this is actually going to go live once I hit the blue button there so you're gonna hit go live once it goes live you'll see there that it says live on Facebook if anybody's tuning in this is just a test then you're gonna go down to the more you're going to record to the cloud and you're going to start your presentation and then at the end of your presentation you're going to end the live stream and the cloud recording and you can end that meeting you are done then you can go back under zoom here For some reason it still thinks we are launching a zoom and that's it the Zoom will show up under the recording library after it finishes the upload. So that's all you have to do is start it, record it, end it, record it.